We're going to jail today. We're, we're Animal Crossing fugitives and we're, we're heading off to jail today. Welcome everyone. We are going to be heading to a jail themed island today. This is Lindsay's island. She is a viewer of the stream. She sent over her dream address and I saw some pictures and it's incredible. The entire island looks like a jail. I always talk about doing illegal things on my stream. So maybe it's about time that I got caught. <laughs> You, if you guys have visited my previous stream address, you guys know that there's a ton of gnomes on my island and it turns out that, you know, that wasn't legal. That was not legal. I was paying them under the table, so, and I clearly was not paying them enough. So I've been busted. I'm heading to jail here. We're gonna take a look around. Oh my gosh, look at the map. That's so interesting. <gasps> there's no rivers. There's no pattern. It's pretty much just like a blank map. Wow. I don't think we've ever seen that before. Wow. Okay, yeah, so we are on the island of Wonderland. There's two residents on here. We have Lacey and we have Lindsay. And we have an interesting set of villagers that all look like they could be fugitives. <laughs> Lindsay sent me the list of villagers and why they were sent to jail. Let's start off at the very bottom with, pa <laughs> with Paula. Carol Baskin killed her husband and fed him to tigers. So she is in jail for life. Tiffany, unfortunately, <laughs> was thrown into jail for indecent exposure. Getting out, you're getting naked out here. Um, Rasher apparently has been sent to jail for assault and battery. <laughs> Rattle at the very bottom, you know, our, our doctor Rattle. Rattle is currently in jail because he was practicing medicine without a license. So, you know, <laughs> distributing those fake vaccines probably. Raymond is in jail on this island. I know this is gonna upset a lot of people, but Raymond unfortunately uh, got busted for tax fraud. So Raymond's in jail. Barold is in jail because he was caught uh, being a peeping Tom, you know, and that's not allowed. So we got to lock him up. We got a little, uh, our little nerdy boy Graham over here. And Graham is currently in jail serving a sentence for computer hacking and cyber stalking. So Rocket is currently in jail because of street racing. You know, she's ready to zoom. She got her racing outfit on, but you know, multiple offenses of street racing, trying to live the Fast and Furious fantasy out here in jail. Bella over here, Ms. Bella out here was uh, caught trying to set things on fire, getting a little bit wild out here, wanted to see the world burn. So Bella is currently in jail for arson. Our final prisoner here on uh, Wonderland Jail Island is Jitters. And of course, you know, we always make jokes about Jitters being cracked out. Jitters is currently serving a sentence for possession of illegal substances. So we were right this whole time. I think we're in court. We're in court. Oh my gosh. This is insane. This is actually pretty bougie for a courtroom. I've been in a courtroom before. Not for myself. I had to do jury duty, but it was very boring compared to this. So I kind of wish that the courtroom looked like this. Oh no, you guys, we've been sentenced to uh, one video in jail. So now we need <laughs> to change into our prisoner outfit and uh, take our mugshot photo. Hold on. Am I allowed to keep, I think I'm allowed to keep my bear hat on, you know, for the branding. Bruh. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. I'm in jail. Oh, and okay, so if we head down and around, this is the front entrance. Oh my gosh. Oh my, no, is that a teardrop? Sup, G? When you walk up from the airport, we reach Texas State Prison, but she's gone a step further because if we go over to the side, even the outside of the prison is decorated with high walls. As you can see, we have the brick walls. Then we have the stone fence behind it that kind of looks like the barbed wire. And then we have the jail bars behind that. Yeah, I just, even the outside of the jail looks like very jaily. Over to the right-hand side of the island is employee parking. Wow, they must be getting paid well over here. Look at all these fancy cars. It seems to be quite empty over here. It's just grassy, but we, you know, we're sustainable jail, I guess. We have solar panels. 
I guess we are technically in Texas because this is the Texas State Jail. You know, we got we got some sun, sunny days. Ooh, okay, so we walk in. This is the employee lounge. I think that's pretty good detail and mapping that out. So from the outside, you walk in, there's vending machines. There's like a TV lounge area, sitting area. Oh no. Oh my gosh. This is the area that you go to when you like want to speak to someone on the other side of the wall. Is this the visitor's area? <gasps> is this real life? Who is the Sachi imposter? Who is she? That's kind of sus. I'm sus to right now. Okay, so there's some phone booths over here in case um, you're a prisoner and you want to make a call. So when you're all done, you know, you finished, you've either been bailed out or, you know, you finished your sentence, I guess. You've served your, you've served your sentence. You check out over here and this is the exit. So over here, this looks like um, the recreation area, I want to say. And then as we head into this area, there are different activity tables set up. Rasher's just wandering around. I guess he's looking for something to do. We should probably stay away from him though, because apparently he got charged for assault and battery. So we should, uh, don't want to, don't really want to fight with him too much do we oh oh okay so wait sorry i'm i'm being corrected here this is the prison store ah this is the store okay i thought this was like like a games room or something okay no never mind ignore me before i think it's called the is it the commissary or the commissary commissary okay so this is the commissary. I think jail cells actually line this entire room. Just super, super basic design. There's nothing really special here, obviously, because I don't think prisoner rooms are decorated that much. Oh, Graham, Graham's in his jail cell over here. <laughs> oh, Raymond's in this one as well. I can't believe Raymond committed tax fraud. And yet somehow he's always at the top of the villager popularity list. So this is the prison cafeteria. This actually looks pretty homey. <laughs> I feel like if your, your cafeteria looked like this in prison, then you'd be quite lucky. You'd be going to a bougie prison. Over to this left side. This is the shower room or like the, the bathroom. Ooh, this is really fancy custom designs actually. Look at this. Someone uses shower shoes. Yeah, I don't know if you'd wanna be barefoot in these showers. I feel like they'd be a little bit grimy, right? And then we head up to what looks like a school. So I know in different prisons and stuff, they do have some educational programs. So you could like take classes in jail. So while we're in the shower, if we head down here to the left, we have entered the laundry room. We've got all of the different clothes up here at the very bottom. You guys can see them hanging. They're hanging up to dry. We've got washing machines over here too. There's detergent, there's an ironing board. If that says Sachi with a bear hat and the orange jumpsuit is it for me. So stylish, I know I'm styling. We gotta look cute in jail, you know, for the branding. Wow. wow. It's a jail. <laughs> we're in jail so, today, look so at me. That you just make a jail. I'm in my jail outfit. <laughs> so this is the uh, prison clinic. So if any prisoners get sick, this is where the doctor will see them. This is where Dr. Rattle will see them. Okay, walking across to the right side, I guess this would be the recreation area. Definitely called a wonderland so the villagers don't get sus flying in from <laughs> Nook Miles Island. I wish you could interact with these. I think it would be really funny if your villager could lift weights up. So we're gonna head out of the recreation area and we're heading to solitary confinement now. And solitary confinement. It's the houses. It's all of the villager houses. So solitary confinement is usually where they put, I think, the most extreme prisoners. Um, and you pretty much don't get contact to anything. You're just sitting in an empty room. But instead, the villagers get their houses because we had to put the houses somewhere, right? I think otherwise, if you place the villagers outside of the jail, you would see them walking around outside. But obviously, we want them to interact with the jail. So they're all indoors. That one time when I did the challenge against Shaperka and I had to take Rasher and it was probably the worst possible villager I could have gotten. Oh, doctor's mask. Ah, that's true. Okay, so yeah, when you do fly in, you know, the Rona is a is a thing so we'll have our uh, mask on lacy says welcome to prison so lacy is the i guess warden of this prison and she says welcome to prison and so let's head over to this house first okay so this room or this house it just kind of looks like a storage space 
Okay, just presents. Lots of presents over here. Oh, ooh, okay. This is cute. We got a little bathroom going on here. Kind of a little bit of a step of a, a step away from the theme. Yeah, this is a very bright and cutesy bathroom over here. <laughs> it's not something you'd really expect on a jail island. I think there's another house. Uh, museum is on the beach. Okay, this is the this is one of them. Ooh, it's funny how like cute and like bright these houses are compared to like the theme and the look of the rest of the island. Okay, this room over here is a brightly colored like pink bedroom. Over to the left side of the island. House, sorry, not the island. Um, there's a little bathroom, a little pink uh, tiled bathroom with some flooring. Okay, so I think that's everything on this island. I don't know if I missed anything else, but this seems like most of it. From what I've seen, obviously, I've never been to a jail before. My only experience with jail is what I've seen on TV. This does seem like it has a lot of the areas that you would find in an actual jail. <laughs> right? Okay, well, thank you so much, Lindsay, for sending in your uh, Dream Suite address. I think it was quite a unique theme from what we've seen compared to like other ones, other islands. Okay. So that was our first dream address for the day. <laughs> She's trying to escape. I'm out, Lindsay. I'm out.